Hey, what's going on guys? For today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to resolve a particular issue that you may run into when dealing with text fields. And what I mean by that is that sometimes when you're working with text fields, when you're trying to design it a certain way, uh, the actual text itself is far to the left and it doesn't look quite right as shown in this example I have here in this app I'm currently working on. You can see the text field itself has a placeholder that's pretty much flush against the left side. And when the user types something here, you can see that it really is on the left side, on the left like border, and it doesn't look quite right. And what you actually want here is some padding. So to achieve that is you would create a custom class, call it a padded text field or whatever you want. Just make sure it's subclassing UI text field. And the first thing you want here is declare a constant called padding of type UI edge insets, right? And let's initialize this to zero, 10, zero, minus 10. Um, feel free to change the values to whatever you want. Um, it may be different for you guys. For me, 10 and minus 10 looks really good. Um, then the next required methods that you need to get this working is firstly, um, something called text, uh, right? Here you want to return uh, bounds dot uh, inset by, uh, here you, s you pass in the padding, uh, constantly declared, declared up up there and then you also need something called placeholder rect uh, here we also return bounds not inset by padding as well and finally we need something called editing rect uh, not that one no, right here so here we return bounds not inset by padding as well and that should pretty much it that's all you really need uh, to get it working so let's give this a run and let's see how it looks now okay so the app has finished running and you can see right off the bat that the text field has padding now you, you can see that because the placeholder um, is a little bit to the right or specifically by 10 um, and when you type something you can actually see for a fact that the actual text is also pushed inwards to the right and in my unzipping it looks way better this way so you guys be the true deciders whether you want this or not but i think it's a best practice to follow um, but yeah, thank you for watching this really short video, uh, but something really common. Um, but yeah, stay tuned for other videos to come. See ya.